Welcome to the Emotional Intelligence series. In today's episode, we're exploring a significant milestone in relationships, moving in together. This step requires more than just love. It demands a deep understanding of each other's emotional needs and a strong foundation of emotional intelligence. Moving in together is often seen as a natural progression, symbolizing a deepening commitment. However, it also introduces new challenges, from managing daily routines to handling finances and personal space. Emotional intelligence is key to navigating these changes successfully. The decision to move in together shouldn't be taken lightly. It's important to have an open conversation about why you want to take this step. Are you ready to deepen your commitment? Or are you motivated by convenience or external pressures? Understanding your motivations ensures you're making this decision for the right reasons. Emotional intelligence helps you navigate these discussions with empathy. It involves not only understanding your own feelings but also being attuned to your partner's emotions. Listen actively to what your partner is expressing, whether it's excitement, anxiety, or hesitation, and address these feelings before they become bigger issues. Discuss your expectations for living together. What does home mean to each of you? How do you envision daily routines and household responsibilities? These conversations may feel uncomfortable, but they are crucial for setting a harmonious foundation. Communication is the cornerstone of any successful relationship, and it's even more critical when living together. Emotional intelligence plays a vital role in how you communicate. It's not just about what you say but how you say it and how well you listen. One common challenge couples face when they move in together is adjusting to each other's habits. Maybe one of you is a morning person, while the other is a night owl. Perhaps you have different approaches to tidiness or meal planning. These differences are natural, but without effective communication, they can lead to misunderstandings and conflict. Emotional intelligence helps you approach these situations with empathy. Instead of reacting with frustration, consider why your partner might have different habits. Are they a result of different upbringings? Or do they reflect deeper emotional needs? By understanding the why behind these behaviors, you can find compromises that work for both of you. Creating a safe space for open communication is crucial. Encourage your partner to share their thoughts and feelings without fear of judgment. If something is bothering you, address it calmly and constructively, focusing on how it makes you feel rather than using accusatory language. Active listening is another key aspect of emotional intelligence. Fully engage with what your partner is saying, showing that you're listening by making eye contact and providing feedback. When your partner feels heard, they're more likely to reciprocate, leading to healthier and more productive conversations. Communication isn't just about resolving conflicts. It's also about maintaining a strong emotional connection. Take time each day to check in with your partner, ask about their day, and share your own experiences. These small moments help strengthen your bond and keep your relationship resilient. Money is often a source of tension in relationships, and moving in together brings financial issues to the forefront. Whether you're combining finances or keeping them separate, it's essential to have a clear, honest discussion about money. Start by discussing your financial goals and values. What are your priorities when it comes to spending and saving? Understanding each other's financial mindset helps avoid misunderstandings and resentment down the line. It's also important to discuss how you'll manage household expenses. Will you split everything 50-50 or contribute based on income? How will you handle unexpected expenses? Addressing these questions before moving in together is crucial. Recognize the emotional aspects of money. For many, money is tied to feelings of security or independence. Be mindful of how these emotions might influence your financial conversations. For example, if your partner is hesitant to combine finances, it might stem from a fear of losing independence. Acknowledge these feelings and work together to find a solution that respects both of your needs. Establish a system for regular financial check-ins. Set aside time each month to review your budget, discuss upcoming expenses, and address any financial concerns. These check-ins ensure you're on the same page and help prevent small issues from escalating. Maintaining a balance between togetherness and independence is another challenge of moving in together. Emotional intelligence helps you navigate this balance by encouraging self-awareness and empathy. 
Reflect on your own needs for personal space. Do you need time alone to recharge? Or do you thrive on social interaction? Understanding your own needs is the first step in communicating them effectively to your partner. Recognize and respect your partner's need for space as well. Just because they want some time alone doesn't mean they love you any less. Maintaining a healthy level of independence can strengthen your relationship by preventing feelings of suffocation or dependency. Consider establishing routines or boundaries that allow both of you to have personal time. This might mean dedicating a specific room or area of your home for individual activities or setting aside certain times of the day for alone time. These practices help ensure that both partners feel fulfilled and respected in the relationship. Maintaining independence also extends to your social life and hobbies. Encourage each other to pursue individual interests and spend time with friends or family. This enriches your individual lives and brings fresh energy and perspectives into your relationship. The goal of moving in together isn't to merge into one person but to build a life that supports both of you as individuals. By maintaining a healthy balance between togetherness and independence, you can create a relationship that is both deeply connected and personally fulfilling. Moving in together is a significant milestone in any relationship, and it requires careful thought, open communication, and emotional intelligence. By understanding each other's motivations, communicating effectively, navigating finances with care, and maintaining a balance between togetherness and independence, you can create a living situation that strengthens your relationship and brings you closer together. Emotional intelligence isn't just a tool for managing challenges, it's the key to building a happy, healthy, and fulfilling life together. As you take this next step in your relationship, continue to cultivate empathy, self-awareness, and mutual respect. These qualities will not only help you navigate the practical aspects of living together but will also deepen your emotional connection and enrich your relationship. Thank you for joining us on this episode of the Emotional Intelligence Series. We hope this discussion has provided valuable insights and tools to support your journey as you take this exciting next step in your relationship. Remember, with the right approach and mindset, moving in together can be a rewarding and fulfilling experience for both of you.